Braves hosting the Giants. The Giants are minus 102 on the money line. The Braves are minus 116. The over under eight and a half runs. The Giants laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 155, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two or more. And the Braves getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 188, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. Webb pitched twice against the Braves last year. Five and a third, five runs, five earned. They lost five, one. He struck out one. Six innings, four runs, four earned. They won six, five. He struck out five. Morton didn't pitch against the Giants last year or this year. The weather in Atlanta for tomorrow's game, and happy 4th of July to everyone, is supposed to be 90 degrees, five mile an hour winds blowing out, and a 28% chance of rain, which sucks because this is a decent pitching matchup, and if it starts raining after this game starts, you're screwed. Head-to-head, -head, these teams are 5-5 five five against each other. The home team is 5-5. Five five. The favorite is 6-4 on the money line. The favorite or the underdog getting or laying runs is 5-5. Five five. There have been two one-run games in their last 10. The under is 6-3-1, and, and the under 8.5 runs is 7-3. The Giants are 3-2 in Webb's last five starts. The over is hitting his last two. The over is 3-2 and two in his last five starts. And his last start was against the Dodgers. Yeah, so back-to-back -back starts against quality teams. Six and a third innings pitched, 6.4 hits, 2.6 earned runs, 6 strikeouts, 1.2 walks, 0.4 home runs, 95.2 pitches per game, and 14.5 pitches per inning. For the Braves, they're 3-2 and two in Morton's last five starts. The home team has won his last five starts, and he was the home pitcher three of those games. All three of his wins in his last five starts, he was the home pitcher. The over is 3-2 and two in those starts. 5 and 2 thirds innings pitched, 3.8 hits, 2.2 runs, 2 of which were earned, 5.6 strikeouts, 2.6 walks, 0.2 home runs, 98 pitches, and 16.9 pitches per inning. The Giants are 2-2 two and two in their last four. 21 runs, 14 runs, 8 runs, 4 runs. 7 runs in a loss, 10 runs in a win, 5 runs in a win, and then 1 run in a loss today. For the Braves, they're 2-2 two and two in their last four. Three runs, six runs, eight runs, four runs. Two runs in a win, two runs in a loss, three runs in a loss, and then three runs in a win. This should be a pitcher's duel. God only knows what's going to happen if it rains or if the bullpen gets involved. So this pick is provided that both of these pitchers actually start the game and the weather doesn't screw it up. I'm going to take the Braves with the money line. I'm going to take the Braves getting the runs as a home underdog, and I will go under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.